amazing to consider that he was already 29 in January 95 when he won his world, first World Cup race in Kitzbühel and only winning his first Super G event in Lax in the previous season. Downhill is pretty much his specialty, but he didn't have all things his own way in Sestria, the World Championships. He crashed out of the downhill and finished 12th in the Super G. But a man who is currently riding high at the crest of the wave, he leads the overall World Cup standings. Has had much success in the downhill this year. Won at Kitzbühel, won at Bormio last year. And now, looking to make it back-to-back -back victories here on the Super G World Cup. He's two hundredths of a second outside the time set by Ormot. The man who is considering Retiring at the end of the season, there's been a lot of speculation as to uh, whether this veteran has decided that he's not going to go for any of the major big wins before he decides to retire or if he's going to make this his last season. He's inside the time now, and this could be another win. Remember, the skiers only have one run. He squashes that, jumps up before the bounce, and that gives him a great lead. 1.15.32. Luke Alfald leads by over half a second from Jetil or more. Omar has to look on. And I'm Jason Roberts, and here in Germany, we're looking at the Super G event. It is the men who are taking to this very tricky and very technically fast downhill slope in their quest for glory. One run is what they have. It's a double header here in Garmisch Partenkirchen, and right now, this is Werner Parathona from Italy, 29 years old. He won here last year, one of only two. Super G wins that he has had in his career, finished 13th in Sestria. And uh, he may consider that his World Cup campaign is not going quite as he might like. Of the two events on the World Cup Super G this year, he finished 24th in Valdez and 10th in last, which is a little bit better. 22 hundredths of a second outside on the first split. And uh, safely negotiates the corner, which was the undoing of Frederick Nyberg from Sweden just a moment ago. The tie to beat still served by Luke Calfon at 1.15.32. And Pelotona now just over half a second outside it. At the split. Any real drop in the run he comes through at 115.90 he moves into second position behind Alfa and that's a good run from Werner Parathona a skier I'm afraid of which we know very little he didn't compete in the world championships in the Super G, didn't compete in Val didn't compete in Lux in Switzerland his best result has been last year where he got an 11th in Kvitfell in Norway and uh, finished in 1996, ranked 106th overall in the world. He's from Flakau in Austria. Well, 18 hundredths of a second, Hermann Meyer is skiing like a dream. When talks about being aggressive, he is throwing everything into this turning nice, early, good tuck. Keeps his body as still as possible, let his legs do the work on the wider turns, just letting the skis run, and now just under, big fun, just over half a second outside as he comes down into the bottom runs of the course. This is inspired skiing by Hermann Meyer from Austria. Over the jump, he flies down across the end of the...